Hi, I'm Janet Moore. I'm a watercolor artist. I live on Madeline Island. Uh, the subject that I generally paint is nature, and I also work with these wheels of time and place images, which are a circular calendar, a journal. Uh, it's a way that you can record things that you observe in nature, but also um, it's a way to reflect on things uh, that are happening within yourself and your world. The one that we're going to work with for this class is a love wheel. And I think of this as expressing the different qualities, the different ways that we nurture ourselves and feel love and how that ripples out into the world. It's all interconnected. So the circle is an eternal symbol. There's no beginning, there's no end. It's a cycle, but it's also a way to think of this is a container, um, a structure that we can contain our vision, organize our vision um, so that we can manifest that love into the world. So the center of the wheel that we're gonna work with is for ourself. Like how do we love and nurture ourselves? Because if we don't love and nurture ourselves, we can't love and nurture others. So that's going to be the content of the center of your wheel. The next ring out is to think about how do we share that love with people in our personal sphere? How is that shared in our relationships with maybe our children, our pets, the things we do, our work place. Um, there's prompts on the wheel here that um, will get those thought processes going so that we can reflect on that and add images, words, whatever you want to do that express that. And then the third ring uh, rippling out from the center is how do we express that universal love? Um, how do we feel that? How do we connect with the divine? How do we think about our larger world, like the whole planet? Like, what do we experience? What would we like to see happen? Um, what are we grateful for in this wheel? What are we grateful for that we have, that we love? And what would we like to manifest? So you can add images from anywhere. There's all sorts of ways to do this. It's not um, a strict art exercise. People do this with collages, with pictures. Um, they do this by drawing, painting, um, whatever comes to you. So it's more of a process versus a product, although it may very well turn out to be a beautiful thing that hopefully you'll get a great start on that you can add to um, throughout the year. I hope you'll join me for the virtual Valentines and we can create some love together and I will give you all the inspiration and guidance you need to get you on your way.